Today I'm going to use the TT Lock app to do the setting and pairing of the Wi-Fi gateway with our Ryzo Smart Lock. So the Wi-Fi gateway that I use is this G2 Wi-Fi gateway. Okay, so first let us open the TT Lock app. From the left sidebar, we choose gateway. Okay, so from here you can see that there's a different type of Wi-Fi gateway so you need to choose which Wi-Fi gateway are you using so for me I will choose this G2 Wi-Fi gateway okay next we need to connect our G2 Wi-Fi gateway to the power supply so you can see after the G2 Wi-Fi gateway connect to the power supply the indicator light is flashing so back to the app click next and add the first Wi-Fi gateway and the next step is you just need to key in your house Wi-Fi and also give a name to the gateway after you successfully added the Wi-Fi gateway into the TT log then you can click the Wi-Fi gateway and check the status so you can see the nearby lock here when you click on it, it will start scanning whether there's a nearby lock or not. So, at here, it shows this Ryzo R300 is connected to this Wi-Fi gateway. Okay, so next, I'm going to show you how to unlock your smart lock through this Wi-Fi gateway. Next, we go to setting. And from the third row, you can see there's a remote unlock. We go and turn on the remote unlock. After you turn on the remote unlock, you can see there's a remote unlock small button here. So this is for you to unlock the smart lock by using the Wi-Fi gateway. So we try to use it. Remote unlock. This is the whole process of pairing and setting the Wi-Fi gateway with your smart lock by using TT Lock app. I hope this video is useful to you. See you in the next video and don't forget to subscribe our channel.